Yo guys, welcome to today's video. As you guys can see, we are here outside of the Paradise Mall. And if you guys can see here, we have some different signages. The Starbucks, Supreme, and also the v v Show IMAX. So v Show is one of the biggest um, theaters here in Taiwan. So it's new and then it just got finished construction last year. The end of last year, so it's quite new as you guys can see. There are a lot of user facilities and buy some of the different uh, souvenirs here. So we'll be showing you guys all of that in today's video. So first, let's go check out the Starbucks right here. It's a container Starbucks. And there are gonna be some, some fun facts, so I'll see you guys later. Okay, so as you guys can see, we are here in the middle of the container Starbucks. And as you guys can see, the design is sort of like a Jenga tower. It's stacked up uh, with the perpendicular containers. And also, there is a drive through here uh, because there's more space to design a drive through uh, So there are a lot of people driving cars, getting their drinks, and going inside to watch the movies. And there are some fun facts such as for the opening day, the first day that they started business right here, they made almost 2 million Taiwan dollars of revenue, which is pretty mind-blowing. But if you actually think about what they sell, it can be very, very imaginable uh, for such profit. And then if we move along here, you guys can see outside of the mall, the tile mural, and they actually cared for it. So now let's go to the certificate for that. Okay guys, so we're here in front of the Tile Mural Arts, so let's go check out behind there, you can see a plaque, and on the plaque is the Guinness World Record uh, certificate for this place for being the biggest Tile Mural Art in the world, so let's go check out uh, the certificate and what it says on top. So here you can say you can see the Guinness World Records uh, organization gave this certificate to us for being the largest ceramic tile mural uh, created by the Taiwan Innovation Development Corporation. So this place is officially amazing. That's why it's one of the Instagram hotspots at this place for now. All right, guys, we're here. We have a, a cup of Starbucks coffee. This cup took us one hour to wait for. And as you guys can see, there are a lot of people lining up to get some Starbucks uh, merchandise, coffee, and food. So let's take you guys inside and see how the interior of Taiwan's first container Starbucks looks like. Okay, guys, so as you, as you guys can see, it's actually not quite big, but also here we have some of the souvenirs and merchandise of the Starbucks coffee. And also here are the legendary uh, souvenir mugs for each and every place uh, that has a Starbucks. For example, this is Taroko in Walian as well. And then bottom we have some different limited editions such as Alisan, etc, etc. And moving on, let's go to the second floor and check out uh, what it looks like upstairs. So one of the parts I love about the Starbucks is they also have these QR codes that you can scan and they will tell you uh, the resumes of all of the containers here, basically the history that they have been through, where they came from, and what they will have been through uh, throughout the years before coming here and becoming Taiwan's first container Starbucks. So let's go up here. Alright, so coming up you can see there is actually a lot of natural lighting. They don't have uh, many man-made artificial lights, but they do have a lot of windows here and there to let the natural sunlight uh, come in. And if you guys can come with me, you guys can see all of these small rooms and small uh, places for people to enjoy their coffee, have various different themes. And also there are always uh, windows for you to see out of. And then uh, if you guys can come over here, the second floor also has some of the utensils you will be needing, some uh, silverware, I mean forks and knives since it's not silver, and also a place uh, for you to put your waste. And then coming over here, we have a place, as I said, it was uh, stacked like the Jenga tower, so there's a container here and a container here, but the middle here is empty. However, there are a lot of windows that you can see out of and enjoy the view.
so it's gonna be gone in a few days. So if you guys are interested in their merchandise, you need to come quick, or it's gonna be gone forever. So as you guys can see in store, they have some merchandise, shoes, clothing, bicycles, some exercising uh, props, and then over here are some dolls and some of the more uh, smaller souvenir items. So remember, if you guys are interested, you need to come quick. And then also this, I think, is the coolest thing here, which is uh, the Supreme Pinball Machine, which has the Supreme logo everywhere on the item. And this gun's app is pretty cool, the theme, uh, the skull, but there's not Supreme on it, so this is probably the only merchandise that is not Supreme branded. And then here are some more of their stock. So remember, if you guys want to say you need to come quick, because this is a flash mob store. Technology that have been lost. She contains technology that have been lost. Okay, guys, so we're here on the third floor. This is the Bicho Cinema ticket booth. And as you guys can see next to me, there is a widescreen wide TV made up of nine screens uh, that play uh, various different trailers of the newest movies come to this and then over here there is the VR land uh, where there are uh, there is an assortment of VR games where you can pay to play with all of your equipment including the HTC Vive headsets. And then turning more to your right you can see there is the Tom Tom's Playland where there are some uh, child games that uh, if they have families coming here the kids can go there to have fun. And then continuing over to the right we can see uh, right here there are some machines where you can do uh, your online book tickets. Um, you can get the tickets that you booked online or if you have a uh, V-Show card you can buy your tickets right here by yourself. However, if you don't have a V-Show card you're going to have to go uh, to the booking booth to buy your tickets manually. And uh, if we move over here we can see that there is a price table right here. Uh, this is the timetable of the entire day, uh, the movies that will, will be playing. So we just watched um, Glass and also Alita Battle Angel on IMAX 3D and also the A Plus uh, Sofa uh, theaters, which were all very, very good. The top quality, very new equipment. And this is the price table. So for Glass, the A Plus, uh, the A Plus uh, theater would be 290 for the normal price. Uh, so that was my mistake. I said 260. And for IMAX 3D, we watched for Alita would be 410. So here is the price table. If you would like to watch some movies here, that is some information that you will be needing to know. And if you want to know more, go to their website to book the tickets online. Yo guys, what's up? As you guys can see, we are inside of the A Hall, which is the only hall with the couch designs here in the Visho Cinema Hualien. Uh, so as you guys can see, there are many rows of couch designs, and there are two people couch designs, which is pretty uh, great if you want to come with friends or your girlfriend, boyfriend, have a date. And then there's also this uh, retractable armrest if you want to uh, put your hand down. And also, it only costs 260 Taiwan dollars per ticket for this room, so I think it's a pretty great bargain. And if you guys can see, beside every chair, uh, there is two USB ports and one socket for you to charge your electronics, which is awesome. Awesome. And then down here there is a place you can put your belongings or bags and also there is a lot of leg area that you can relax and have a great time. So this is a pretty good bargain for a pretty good time to watch the movies. So now let's go over and check out the IMAX 3D room. So we're here outside of the IMAX theater. You guys can see I have the tickets for the Alita Battle Angel IMAX 3D version and I'm wearing this IMAX 3D glasses. Uh, so what these glasses does is the IMAX 3D technology uses two different projectors projecting onto the theater screen. The seats are all the same with the other theaters, uh, but the two different projectors uh, project different kinds of lights. 
and these glasses, they filter those kinds of lights. Uh, so the right side is for your right eye and the left side is for your left eye. The glasses filter these lights and by filtering, uh, only one of the projector's lights enter each of the eyes and your eyes and your brain will together combine it into a three-dimensional three image to trick your brain into thinking that what you're watching is in three dimensions.